How are the tests? Mr. and Mrs. Lubitsch, he was born exactly like your first son, with no amenities whatsoever. But he's alive. How long does he have to stay in this? There's no way to know. Until we discover a treatment, until he develops an immune system of his own, he'll have to remain in his protected environment. Surely you can give us some kind of a prediction. I mean, are we talking about days or weeks or months? Years. <laughs> give me a kiss. Oh, boy! You wanna play ball? You wanna play ball? Get your ball. We're gonna toss. You get over here, why don't you? Okay. Look out, here it comes. Whoa, oh, good. Try it again. Now you throw it to me. Good one. Good man. He's always watching television, you know? He never comes out of his room. Does he have any friends? Mm-mm. Just old people. Like friends of his parents. A bunch of doctors that come over. And some minister or something comes over once in a while. But no kids or anything. Oh, he has this little pet germ-free mouse, too. Don't you ever wonder what it's like in there? I mean, to be all by yourself like that. Yeah. Yeah, I know. But he's weird, you know? Like, I'm surprised he isn't looking at us right now. Every time I look up there, he's looking right at me. <laughs> It's gone far enough. Unless every one of you want to be sent down to the principal's office, you'll cut it out right now. <laughs> I'm so sick of it. I'm so sick of feeling like a hospital case. Like some weirdo kid who, who can't even breathe normal air because he might get sick and die. I just want to be like a man. Someone you could care about. And not feel sorry for. I've always loved you, you know. week I've been in telephone communication with a team of physicians in the Soviet Union. How soon could I leave on my own immunities? You know I can't answer that. What would happen if I left now? You're not actually considering... Would I catch something and die right away? I really don't know. You mean I might live? Yes, it's conceivable. Your body's been building up some immunities. But it's also conceivable that just a bad cold or a case of flu might kill you. I'm sorry, but we just don't know. What would they say if we up and ran away? Ran away. Thank you.